Hey everyone, it's Rita. So this is actually going to be my very first vlog. I've never vlogged before, so just keep that in mind. I just wanted to try it out. I just received this new camera today, actually in the mail, so I'm pretty excited about it. We're about to head out. Today's Friday the 12th? 15th? 15th. Friday 15th, and we're about to go head out to have some dinner with one of my friends. And... We're getting ready. We are going to go to Maggiano's to have some Italian and some seafood. So we'll probably vlog a little bit in there. But yeah, we're about to leave our house. We're all set and we'll see you in a bit. ahead of us we have I have to edit and film a video and Michael has to do some work but I have to do a lot of work around the house I still have a mess from the trip that we just arrived a week ago and I can't do much because of my surgeries I'm kind of like trying to take it slow but today I really do have to pick up and tidy up and do some cleaning how to do some laundry then I have to film I have to edit and then at some point tonight, we're going to be meeting some friends to have some a game night. Probably order some pizza so I don't have to cook. But I'll probably take you along my day-to-day, -day, just little snippets here and there. Michael's going to be working, so it's not going to be as exciting for him. But I do have to do a lot of cleaning. I'll probably show you, do kind of like a little clean with me real fast during this vlog. But yeah, it's a mess. That's all I'm going to say. Are you excited for today? Saturday. <laughs> we just woke up. I don't know what Saturday means. First things first, you have to make the bed. So let's get to work. I'm gonna go ahead and do my skincare real quick because I do have to film uh, Charlotte Tilbury's first impression in the second eyeshadow palette and I will be posting that probably Monday. So keep an eye out for that video. This is going to come after that video. So yeah, it's probably gonna be up by the time you are watching this video. But right now, I'm just going to go ahead and wash her face to get ready to start filming. So I've been trying for Michael to start using more of his lotions. I did ha I did just purchase him a new eye cream, the this Exuvians. I don't even know how to pronounce that. Comprehensive Age Rewind. And then he's using a Peter Stomach's Rough on his face, which is just a regular moisturizer. It's called the Water Drench Hyaluronic Cloud so Cream. So this is my secret to staying young, everyone right here. As everyone knows, guys always look good, so oh my God, what I feel like if I put product on, Here. then I'll just look better than everyone else. Oh my God. This is my husband, you guys. He is so weird. I can't do it with him. Apparently, guys always look better. I mean, we don't do anything. Well, now you are. Because wow. we need to keep you young. There you go. This is the beautiful pile of laundry I have to do after the one that it's already going. So here you go. What the hell is this? That's your eye cream. It was very expensive. I actually got it at the Ulta 30 Days of Beauty. This lotion is usually 
eighty dollars. That's crazy. Eighty dollars. I mean, it's kind of like BioSense. The one that I have cost around sixty, I think. So this one is. How do you do it? You just pump a little bit, like a tiny bit, on your finger. No, no, no. On this finger. You always use this finger. No. That one. Okay. Rude. There you go. That's way. That's enough. And then separate and bolt your fingers, and then put it on your own right. No, on your other finger, the same finger. No, your other hand. Yes, there we go. Yeah, that's enough. Okay, now put it on your eyes, on your under eyes. That's exciting. You try not to rub. You try to pat. There we go. Okay, did you move it all the way down to your cross feet? Yes. What did you say? Cross. Crossfit? <laughs> Maybe your crow's feet? You know, whatever. Okay. Yes, All I done. got my CrossFit. All done. So here's a quick little behind the scenes. We're actually filming something different for my YouTube channel today. We're going to have a segment where Michael, which if you didn't know, Michael is an actual chemistry doctor. So he's going to be helping me to kind of like go over some formulations of makeup and skincare to add just like a tiny segment on my channel. But this is the first time we're doing it, so wish us luck. Are you excited? Mm -hmm. It was your idea. Of course you're excited. Of course I'm excited. It's chemistry. Why wouldn't I be excited? Oh, well, there he goes. <laughs> well, good luck. We're back in the bathroom and somehow now I'm wearing a different robe. I was wearing my pajamas earlier. I just kind of like put on a robe on top and some uh, leggings or some joggers and Robin is going crazy outside. It's super late already. It's literally almost 2 o'clock. It's 1.30 and I still haven't filmed so I'm very behind today. I'm about to do my makeup because I'm going to be doing the uh, eyeshadow palette review from Charlotte Tilbury but I do have to have like my full face and I don't really like to do that on camera. So I'm going to go ahead and do my makeup right now. So not a good idea but I decided to randomly just completely empty my vacuum and clean it, wash it like the filter and that's what we're working with right now. I'm kind of like waiting for it to fully dry because it's still very wet, the filter. So once it's dry, I'm gonna be able to vacuum and mop my house, which is what I have to do before we have our friends over. And this is the makeup that I'm gonna be using. I kind of like just brought everything to the bathroom because it has better light. I need to finish up doing my makeup real quick so I can actually uh, film the video, but I'm going to be using for base Charlotte Tilbury because I just thought it would make sense since I'm filming a Charlotte Tilbury video. And then a couple of my powders, brows, I'm going to use a concealer from Fenty, I'm sorry, Rare Beauty. And then more Charlotte Tilbury, some Chanel. So yeah, I'm just going to get ready real quick and then we can finally start filming the first video of the day. So I'm now all done with my makeup. I just finished filming the actual first impressions. I mean, not really because I still have to go back, sit down and give my first impressions but so far I can actually tell you because this video is gonna come up afterwards so here is what the eyeshadows are looking like I love them I mean I feel like this quad is like the ultimate Charlotte Tilbury like supermodel eye look it's just beautiful the sparks in the eye are just something else I mean I really love her formula. This one is a very different one. A very different one from all the ones she created before. Even different one from the other quad that I have from this same collection. But this one just blew my mind away. I really, really love it. I feel like it's the perfect eyeshadow palette. Like if you're getting married, if you're having like an important event. I'm just looking down so you can actually see the eyeshadows. They're just amazing. I am really loving them. By the time this video comes up, it doesn't really matter because... I've already, um, I've already posted the actual first impressions. I do need a little pick me up. It's already 2.30, so I had to make some tea. I haven't actually had tea all day, which is surprising. Sometimes during the week weekend, weekends, I get so busy doing other things that I kind of like forget to drink my tea, but I definitely need it right now, especially because we're gonna have company later today. I'm probably gonna be serving myself a ton of tea but it's just necessary. I don't drink any coffee, if you didn't know that, so tea is my caffeine boost. And I actually love, 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 love tea. Today we're doing some Irish breakfast for right now. So yeah, 
let's go ahead and boost our energy up and i have to keep on filming so here is our table for tonight's dinner i kind of did not vlog anymore during the day i was just super busy but i did get from marshall's this new table set table settings i guess and then this super pretty uh, napkins to match so i want to do something a little more valentine-y i guess so i picked up those just a matching one and i think it looks very pretty my china is white with just gold rim so i feel like it's very easy to mix and match with other sets which is another reason why i love it something so easy to kind of like match it's probably the best thing you can do whenever you're picking like china because you can literally just get accent plates or salad plates to make everything just a little bit you know different especially with like changing seasons i do like to have something something a little bit different so i didn't really do anything much right now because we did order some tacos so we'll have the tacos so we really don't need much of the china out but that's kind of like our table and then i finally got the apartment clean we cleaned everything tidied up everything and we got our lights on we still have our christmas tree on we still have it here but it's probably gonna come down in a couple of weeks we are going to be using as a prop for some christmas pictures taken a little bit late but we have kind of like still the christmas but we also have already incorporated a few decor for valentine's which is little snippets here and there like that and here in my bar cards i do have a couple of little things not much because again i don't like to have a lot of clutter but just like little things i want to get another little garland for the bar cart do you like the valentine's decorations i think we need more i think so too i think i want to get a garland for there but we need to go to target target had really pretty ones i wanted or whenever we went to marshall's and we got those things they didn't have much but the lady that i was speaking with because i was like hey is there any more valentine's coming up and she was like oh yeah we have a ton of things coming out so i do want to get a couple more things and i probably i still have like our stockings hanging again it's just for a prop for some props because one of my best friends is coming home and she's a photographer and i do want to get some christmas pictures because we didn't get them as a family this year we did with my parents back home but pinto was not in the pictures and remus was not in the pictures so i do want to have like all of the guys together so we're gonna we get some need, we also need to christmas. get them cupid outfits cupid uniforms oh that would be really adorable it would i haven't thought about that but that would be really cute mm -hmm. i wonder if petco sells something like that they got they got dressed for um halloween and they loved it they were all batman they were all batman and remus was a prisoner but yeah we're just waiting on our friends and we're gonna have some dinner and have some game night which is pretty exciting what's the strength on that hero Mm, three. three. It's time for coffee and tea. Why do you want all the Irish? Um, because I'm sleepy and that helps me wake up more. We're playing um, Bolinus. And I'm playing Maleficent. Because I'm really bad at this game, let's be realistic. And I never win, so she's pretty easy. She's like probably for like beginners, so that's why I play. I've never won. And Michael is always cheating with this guy. He says no, but his name is Sneaky Pete. So that probably tells you something. And then my friends, I don't know if they want to be unnamed, uncensored. What? I have a copy, a cuff, a cup right here in front of me. Yeah, but that one's not gold. This one's gold. Oh my God. <laughs> Just go away. They're both gold. Um, I'm done. I can't do anything now. Is it my turn? Yes. So I'm really good at this game. Uh, I always win. I always beat her. Sneaky piece. Even with literally mm -hmm. a very difficult character to play with. So um, just watch me win again. Oh, whatever. Are you done? Yes. You haven't played. Actually, I, I don't think I'm going to win this one. Good. Can anyone fade him yet or no? Who? Michael? Yeah. Oh, I have a fade card. You're about to win, so. 
No, I'm not. She only has two curtains. I only have two curtains. Good morning. Today is Sunday the 17th. I do have a little bit of a late start. Uh, not really because I've already uh, did some laundry, had breakfast, did my skincare. I need to film. I'm going to be filming the Rare Beauty First Impressions video. I do have to make the bed today. Sundays is a day that I actually uh, strip my bed and wash the sheets. I do that every week. So today is laundry day for the sheets. They're actually about to be um, out of the dryer. But I like to make it regardless. So I'm probably just going to wait for it to be out. And then I'll make the bed. And today I don't think I'm going to be uh, blogging a lot. I do have a lot of uh, errands to run. I'm going to go get my nails, my pedicure done later today. And just running some errands. Going to the grocery store. We are going to start. Michael and I are going to start a diet. Like an actual diet. That um, we're getting from like a specialist. So I need to go grocery shopping for whatever's on that list. And what else do I have to do? I have to go to H&M real quick to exchange uh, two hoodies that I got. Because I did get like two sets of like loungewear. But the top parts are a little bit big on me. So I want to exchange those. And I think that's it. I think that's all I have to do. I can't remember at this point. And at some point during today I have to edit tomorrow's video. Which is going to be the one for Charlotte Tilbury. So anyway, that's what we're up to. Michael is not home right now because he's uh, working. Um, he's studying and working. So he's actually at a little... We have like a little studio place here in our apartment complex. So he's like just uh, spending some time there studying. But I do have to finish cleaning out my bedroom. I, we did have company yesterday with my friends. So my, my house in general is pretty clean. It's just my bedroom I need to tackle. Just a couple of things that are out of place. So just tidying up. But yeah, I'll probably see you around whenever I'm done filming. So probably around a couple of hours. So I'll see you then. I'm all done with my video of the day. I still do have to edit. But we have to go grocery shopping because we have to go see. We have to go get the food for our week for our diet. But right now, he's having his breakfast just now. Do you like your fruit? Mm -hmm. Are you excited for the new diet? So we actually got like a, a professional diet done for the both of us. A nutriologa. 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 So tomorrow, life starts over, <laughs> changing to better habits. So we have to go to the store to do some shopping. And then he has to get back to work. And I have to edit. And I do have my pedicure appointment at 5. So all of this has to be done pretty fast. At 2 o'clock I have a Zoom get together with the Living Dappled uh, group. Which is a really good uh, group that uh, was started by the founder of the blog Living Dappled. So if you have vitiligo or you know someone who has vitiligo that's a woman because it's just a woman's group. Uh, I'll leave here her information. If you're interested, definitely let someone in your life know that might have the LIGO. It's a really, it's a really cool uh, group of women who just, you know, we understand each other, I guess, because we all have the same thing. And once a month, I believe we're going to have, they're called discussions. So basically, we just get in Zoom and talk about a specific subject that one of the girls is presenting. So yeah. That's going to be from 2 to 3, and then after that, we probably have to go grocery grocery shopping, and then it's my appointment at 5. And then I have to come back to get my video edited for tomorrow's post. And for workout. Are you going to eat something else? No, that was my workout fuel. That was just fruit. Well, I'm going to come back and eat something else after workout. Okay, there's leftovers. But, I don't know. Today is our last day to eat, though. <laughs> to eat as a free individual with no attachment, no... ¿Cómo se dice? I think fish and vegetables will be a pretty good meal every day. Yeah, that's what we're going to have. That's what we have every day normally. But now it's going to be like... Wait, so we... Let me get this straight. So we eat fish and vegetables every day normally. Yes. And then we paid someone yes. so that they could determine 
and tell us that yes. we should eat fish and vegetables every day. Yes. Gosh, I'm tired. We just I just got back from one of my friends' house and I picked up my remaining packages from what I bought in December. Which is just two things, but yeah. Now it's getting late. I need to shower. What are you doing? I need to shower and get ready for bed and wake up early and see this heart? Mm -hmm. Is that yours? Yeah. It's on the door. See? There's a key that goes to that door. Really? So that is the key to her heart. Well, what a romantic. Thank you, Miss Paul. Did you have dinner? Mm -hmm. Tomorrow we start a diet, so I was in desperate need to say goodbye to my former life. So I went to McDonald's and ordered some medium fries with a small Diet Coke. I just could not stop myself. It was so delicious. I had what I would normally have when she's not here, which is cheese, cheese and olives, olives, and some kind of meat and wine and wine. We had no meat. I found some. Apparently, all leftovers from the restaurant. But we are now going to get ready for bed. These guys are having some fun. That's Bindo, and that's Romulus. It's almost 10 o'clock. It's definitely bedtime for us. I just showered. I don't wash my hair every day. I wash it like twice a week. So today, usually I want to like start the week with a clean hair. And then before the weekend, I wash my hair. So anyway, I did wash my hair today. We are already in bed, ready to go to sleep. We're trying to get into a new habit of waking up really early. I mean, really early for us, but at like between 6, 6.30 the latest. Just because we have a lot of things to do in the mornings. Michael has to study. <laughs> He's enjoying his last cup of wine. Are you excited? This is the cup of sadness. <laughs> because this is my last glass of wine or alcohol for how long? I don't know, like three months maybe? Because of the diet that we're going to start. So all we can drink in the diet is basically just water. That's it. I mean, I told Michael, like, one of my best friends is coming um, It's coming to visit us in a couple of weekends. I'm going to eat. I'm going to allow myself to eat whatever I want and drink whatever I want. But other than that, we're going to be, we're going to try to be pretty strict with our diet. Just follow it as, you know, we are receiving it or whatever, I guess. But um, we enjoy our wine from time to time. So... There's gonna be no more wine, only water, which I'm okay with. I love drinking water. What is this? This is pretty good. That's it's a, a it's bubbly. A, it's a sparkling Moscato. So it's kind of sweet, which is good before bed. It's not so good with food, uh, but it's pretty good. A sparkling Moscato. That's like my favorite wine, Moscato in general. And then we got that just randomly like a sparkling wine. Uh, and it's really, really good. But anyway, we're heading to bed. I know this weekend wasn't too exciting, but we didn't do a lot of things, or we did, but I don't know. We didn't we didn't film a lot, just because we were actually enjoying the time with our friends, and they're not YouTube people, so they don't really, I don't think they appreciate like being filmed. So hopefully next weekend there's new adventures, and we have a Harmon Park date pending, because we want to go on the train, so hopefully we can do that next weekend. We do have to go to the outlets, because this guy... Doesn't have any more jeans. I need so some pants. He needs some pants. <laughs> yep, he <I> need pants. <laughs> okay, sorry about that. But anyway, anyway, we're heading to bed. Uh, it's very late. We have to wake up tomorrow at 6.15 in the morning. I have to edit video. I have to probably get to work a little bit earlier, working from home still. And we have to do or prep our breakfast and our lunch for our first diet day tomorrow. So all of those things I have to do before work, hopefully we can achieve them, or at least I can. He just has to go to study and work. So anyway, we'll see you next weekend. Um, thank you for watching. Give it a big thumbs up. If you did like this vlog, definitely we are going to be filming more coming your way. So be sure to subscribe so you don't miss those.
Cheers to sadness. <laughs> Cheers to his last cup of wine. Anyway, you guys, thank you. I'll see you in the next one. Bye.